Students at one Buffalo school are going home with some new skills today thanks to a surprise visit from two Olympic gold medalists. The unique program is called Classroom Champions. It connects top performing athletes to students using video lessons and social media. Seven Eyewitness News reporter Paula Suro has the story from West Hurdle Academy. From gold medals in the Olympics to heroes in the eyes of students, gold medalist Steve Mesler and two-time Paralympic gold medalist Adam Page surprising fifth graders this morning at West Hurdle Academy. It's all part of their Classroom Champions program, which allows both of these Western New York natives to give back to their hometown. Make their classrooms a place that is like the Olympics or Paralympics, where kids are setting big goals and they're following the steps to get there and they're understanding that sometimes they're going to fall on their way to get there. And really at the end of the day, if classroom champions can help teachers change that in their classrooms, that's when we know we're doing a good job. This mentorship program aims to teach students leadership skills with a champion by their side, just like Adam Page, a former Sabres player who won gold at the Sochi and Vancouver Paralympics. Page was born with spina bifida, a rare defect that doesn't allow your spinal cord to develop properly. But that doesn't stop him. Even though, you know, I'm born with a disability or anything like that, you know, I'm still just like anybody else. and. Um, you know, and that they'll have bumps in the road with their goals and, and dreams, and it's always to try to keep a positive attitude and, you know, to, to keep pushing through and always keep going every, every time. And this program keeps growing. Mesler, the founder of Classroom Champion, says the program has gone from one classroom in Buffalo to ten this year. To see the results that teachers are getting. Uh, and to see how that's changing their classrooms is what we're doing this for. Paula Suro, 7 Eyewitness News.